I don't know what it is with America, United States, okay, but they are seriously a warring nation. It's not like we don't know this. I mean, everyone's going on about what Trump did with 59 cruise missiles and what he's going to do with North Korea. But can you remember when you had that race-baiting piece of trash in power, Obama or Obama, that he was at the helm of seven wars while he was in power for eight years? Every president has their wars. If you look at it, you can see all the way back, the Clinton, Bush, Reagan, all got the wars. And don't you just love America departing their version of democracy via laser-guided missile? I mean, this is the country with the biggest arsenal of NBC, NBC weapons, okay? And they also love pushing that lie about other nations with weapons of mass destruction. Well, meanwhile, back at the ranch, they're the only nation on Earth who've dropped two, not one, two nuclear bombs on another nation. So this video, again, is a rant about, I mean, don't get me wrong, I love America. It's an incredible country and in what it's achieved. But it's also achieving other things that are very negative. And now I'm not just talking about what they've done in Syria with their 59 missiles, cruise Tomahawk missiles. I'm talking about the build-up and the military um, escalation going on down by South Korea, North Korea. What the fuck are you doing, America? When's enough enough? You are a warring nation. I mean, if, let's get it right. If you had a civil war going on in your country right now, you wouldn't have a fucking time shit-stirring World War Three around the globe. What the fuck is your problem? Can't you secure that shit? What is it? You know, shoot between the legs and you feel you've got to impress the world? What is it about you neocons and your lust and hard-on for kicking off New World War Three? Give it a break, will you? 99.9% .9 of the people on this planet don't want it. We just want to raise our families and enjoy ourselves.